Okay, so delighted to announce Graham to offer you the client of the month for June of 2018. Um, we've been working together four or five months now. Uh, and again, from our point of view, it's been an absolute pleasure to watch you implement the bits that, um, that we've asked you to do and see you get the benefits. And, and actually for you, see your body literally change before our eyes on a kind of week to week basis. So just to recap a little bit more, just tell me a little bit more about why you came to work with us in the first place. Yeah, so the reason why I came to work with you is I was suffering from a lower back pain. Um, I was going to go to a chiropractor, but then I saw, I've, I've met you before, so I thought, you know, I'll, I'll message Jim. I came in to see Jim at JT Ethos. Um, he pinpointed what was actually wrong with me, but then he sort of almost made me realise that it wasn't just my back, it was other factors of my body which were making my back hurt. And to make my back stop hurting forever, you'd have to correct these few different things. Um, and then we started to talk about lifestyle, diet, exercise, and from then on, it's just been absolutely fantastic. Okay, great. So again, your your time here has been enjoyable. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my 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 time here has been absolutely fantastic. I've learned so much about diet, nutrition, exercise, flexibility, stretches. And you've you've had quite an interesting take on the the sort of things we've had to learn, haven't you? Because you know, in a few months' time, you're going to be sort of moving things about completely. So just tell us a bit more about mm. about that and how how you've been able to adapt to that mm, and what course. we've done. Yeah. So another one of my goals was when I came to see Jim at JT Ethos was a because I was quite a self conscious person, so I didn't want to be able to take my top off at the beach. I couldn't do it. But one of my goals was to take my top off at the beach, and that fits in perfectly. In a couple of months, we'll be travelling the world. Me and my partner going to New Zealand and then around Asia. Um, so to have that body and to have make me feel comfortable in my own skin is ideally what I wanted to get to and it's where I'm getting to now. Um, there's going to be challenges up ahead with diet and stretches and flexibility, but Jim and JT Ethos has kind of talked me through ways around that and how to adapt to the lifestyle I have now over there. So, okay, and so so what does it feel like now you've got that confidence and now you've got, you know, you're sort of, you know, you're not dreading getting onto the beach? Yeah, the confidence I've got at the minute is absolutely fantastic in my body, you know, my chest is sticking out and my posture feels great and, you know, I just feel, I feel a, a foot taller than everyone else, you know, it's, I'm just, not, not in a snobby <laughs> way or a, I just feel good yeah fantastic and yeah I mean, it's been interesting one of the things we've talked to you about is actually looking you know looking up and looking over people because you are a tall guy um and you know that what that gives is your your posture when it's right looks you know that much more impressive and uh, and that's been a you know a real development that i've seen in you which you know which is good um and so you know obviously you talked about traveling in the future um and actually we've just finished a session now talking about you know how you might adapt what you've learned and what's been working for you into that so do you feel sort of you know comfortable and confident that you'll be able to do that yeah i'm very confident that i'll be able to carry on what i'm doing here abroad I mean, it's the same, different cultures, but the same basic concept, you know. Mm. I've been doing the diet stuff now for maybe about four or five months, so it, it's become a lifestyle, so I know what's got certain stuff in. You know, you can look at some foods and think, that's got that in, you can look at others, that's got that in. Sometimes you have to look at the back of the packet, and you, I do normally anyway, because, you know, it's better to be safe than sorry. Um, but, you know, when we're in Asia, and we've got the street food and stuff, it gives me a much better understanding of, what's got dairy in it, what's got gluten in it, you know, what's particularly good for me, what's particularly mm. not good for me. Okay, well, great. I mean, look forward to sort of hearing the feedback on uh, on how you manage that and hearing the uh, the tales as you go. But again, many congratulations from us here. Um, thoroughly well-deserved and uh, enjoy the rewards. Thank you, yeah. Just a bit of a Champions League trophy. Yeah. <laughs>